Brontosaurus acres in the early Cretaceous time period. Enjoy the dino ball game, Pteranodon family. Thanks, we will. There's that roaring crowd the conductor told us about. Just in time, the game's about to start. playing dino ball back in our nest. Well, here come the players now. And there he is, kids. The best of the best. Hank and Kyle Saurus. Look, he's covered with hard, bony plates, even above his eyes. Whoa, check out Hank's tail. It's like a big club. And those legs. They may be short, but they look really powerful. I know, and even his legs have plates. I wonder what they're made of, and I wonder how hard they are. Really hard, buddy. <laughs> We're about to see him in action, cause it's the kickoff! Wow, did you see how fast he swung that tail? <laughs> look at Hank go! That's the Hankster, unstoppable. Hey, look at the other players. You okay, Jerry? Yeah, fine. Never felt better. They aren't hurt a bit. It's all that armor plating. I think my hypothesis about Ankylosaurus is right. Their armor plates completely protect their bodies. Yeah, Hank didn't even feel that big gourd when it hit him. But all that heavy armor means they can't move their bodies as fast as other species. Except their tails. Look. Hey, hey, we destroyed. You're a pigmen dinosaur. Us. Kids, we just witnessed the greatest dino ball goal ever. Now look, the game's almost over. Oh. Oh. Time there was a mom, her name was Mrs. Pteranodon. Sitting on her nest, she heard a scratching and said,